everybody, we're at Colonia de la Paz and we are gonna go in and take a nice tour of the residence halls and maybe even talk to some students about residence hall life. I've loved every second of it. I've met so many new people. The dorms are fun, very social. I really love living in the residence halls just because there's so many people. I really like it here, it's very open. Lots of great experiences, lots of programs. I don't know, it's a great living environment. Like, Res Life gets a lot, a lot of free food, so any Res Life experience with free food, uh, I'm down. For me, the best part of living in the dorms was the proximity to my classes. For me, I think it's a convenient level, living on campus. You can wake up five minutes before class and still get there on time. Everything is right here, you know, I can walk to any class. It's really fun. Like, I am so glad that I lived in a residence hall my freshman year and that I continue to live in a residence hall. It's definitely an adjustment. You have to adjust to a lot of things because you're used to having your own space, your own bathroom. Now you have to share a room, you have to share a bathroom with lots of other girls. It's like the real world. I ended up making friends pretty easily and I really didn't think I would because um, I'm pretty shy. Don't make a mess in the bathroom. People have different preferences about the community bathroom. It's not that bad. I've never had to wait for a shower or anything. People are, are like pretty clean and normal so it wasn't like a traumatizing experience. It's like summer camp actually but every day. And you get used to it. <laughs> it's, not, it's not bad at all. So we're one of the uh, courtyards at the residence halls, and this is just a great place to come and relax. This isn't just one of the only places where you can do that. You can also do that in one of the study lounges. Take your laptop in there, do some homework, chill, whatever you guys like. I actually live in the pre-health professions wing, which um, each hall has a different one. Like I know La Paz has the future teachers wing, Gila has uh, future engineers. It's really helped me out a lot um, being with people who are in the same classes as me. I personally like love our faculty fellow at Coconino. Like every faculty fellow is a specialist in a certain department. It's kind of like having an advisor in the dorm. They let you know like professors are really there to help. They're not there to like fail you. <laughs> and also study groups. You know, you get together with friends and uh, do assignments for common classes. And the class lists are really helpful when it comes to like exams. Well, the tutor and residence hall program is also just normal residents. They can sign up with their expertise for a certain amount of classes. Any students in the dorms can see the signs and they can call them or email. Why did you choose to live in an honors dorm as, as opposed to a regular dorm? Well, I am an honors student and, and plus just being around other students who go through the same experiences as me. There is uh, just little things that show the focus on like studying and academics. I'm living in Gila Hall. I love it. So I actually didn't get my first choice res hall, which at first seems kind of scary. I liked the residence hall I was put in a lot more. And, uh, I really liked the people in it, so it was, you know, a really, really pleasant surprise. We are just in one of the hallways, Colonia de la Paz, and we are right in front of the hall director's door. The hall director is going to be one of your main sources when living in residence hall. I thought the RAs were mean guys, mean people, like dictators. Definitely not. Most residents know, know, don't know that RAs have lives too. <laughs> we're not police, but a lot of residents think we are. I see them a lot. They're always around to hang out with the residents. Uh, my RA and I have a pretty good relationship. My RA, I've actually had her for two years now, and she is really helpful. We do a bunch of intramural sports, and so he, he plays with us. He's been a friend, he's been a tutor, he's been a counselor. She leaves her door open, we watch Desperate Housewives together. The desk assistants, we go and talk to them all the time. In our custodial staff, I love them. I'm like friends with them, I talk to them all the time, and they really care about like making it clean. They really like made it so it felt like home and not like just a square box. 